So it's me, your little boy, Ike Samson. I have something unique for us choosing words today. You know, their rejection is God adequate provision. You know what? And provi provision and protection. Let me tell you, many people who reject you, majority of them today are now regretting because they have finally come to understand that their rejection is God with provision, is God protection, is God securing, is God with elevation, and is God with promotion to you. So they rejected you because they have no idea that you are the chief cornerstone. You know, the Bible said that the, the, the stone that the builder rejected will end up becoming the chief cornerstone. So majority of people up there are absolutely sure because whom they rejected have now end up become the chief cornerstone. Whom they rejected as nobody have now end up become somebody. So this is something that is costing a lot of people up there heartbreak. This is something that is frustrating many people up there because God provision is something that they rejected meaning that you carry the provision and they rejected you not knowing that the rejection will end up bringing out the greatness in you yes they were not seeing what you carry but that is not enough reason to reject to reject you that is not enough proof to conclude you that is not enough word guarantee to look down on you so majority of people who have looked down on you talk down on you believe me many of them today are now regretting why they did all they have done many of them today are now regretting why they talk down on you many of them today are now regretting why they look down on you because they never in their lifetime believe that it will be like that they never in their lifetime believe that it will act like that so their rejection is now god provision so god keep providing all your needs despite of all their reject all their rejection despite of all that they have said despite of all that they have talked despite of all that they have did so many people up there are now absolutely hurt so much because they have fully come to understand that they made the biggest mistake of rejecting you they have fully come to understand that the highest error they made was what was rejecting you the highest error they commit is rejecting you. So it's something that is pissing many people up there off. It's something that is boiling them because they never believe that whom they rejected will end up become the chief cornerstone. They never believe that whom they talk down on will end up become someone that they will need the most. They never believe that real, their, what they call rejection will end up become the chief cornerstone whom they rejected. So it's something that is eating a lot of people alive because their rejection is now your what your provision. It's just like a shelter. It's just like what people said, hey, you will not be able to make it. They decide to take a roof from you, an old roof because of envy, jealousy, and malice. And they end up after a after two days or one day of removing the old or the old roof, they come to figure out that you have all that someone have already given you a new brand what proof roof over your head it's just like when someone threw you out thinking that you won't be able to see a shelter no matter how and at that the same particular moment they see someone who pick you and give you a mansion it's just like when we pray for god to give us a house he give us mansion when we pray for god to bless us he blessed us and placed us in a position where we control where we blessed others 
So this is something that majority of people out there are absolutely going through because they are tired of the fact that you are blessed above them. Remember blessed?